All right. All right. So in in opinion about the the Oakleys, um, scale of one to ten, I give them about a seven. I give them a, a ten in appearance. Uh, I give them I give them a seven in the durability. It feels like and, and what they feel like. Um, the lens is uh, is good. It's, uh, it's polarized, but it's I mean I don't know. I haven't got the real Oakleys to see if how different they are, but uh, we'll wait to see uh, when I make that video when I get those ones. But so far these ones uh, I'm very happy with. Again, knockoffs, knockoff Oakleys. I think they're uh, I think uh, they're a good good buy, great buy if you can get them. You know. Again, the cycling is it's overpaid. You know, too much money involved in it. Yeah, they created a monopoly with it to where you have to go to them and the type of thing to get it done. So for the for not the, for the everyday rider, um, I would go these this route right here because uh, how many times have you got your helmet strap hooked around you know one side of them and they go flying scraping across the fucking pavement you know <laughs> you know what 250 bucks scraping across the pavement you know we've all been there so uh like i said uh comment in the space below let me know what uh you think uh if anyone has got uh, if anyone's doing the same kind of kind of uh, little experiment i am with uh, let me know what uh, how your your experiment went and what you found um what your opinions are and uh Feel free to tell me I'm a fucking idiot or whatever the case may be. But knock off Oakley's. Thumbs up. <clears throat> rare, rare breed bikes, Seattle, Washington.